Representative Leo Berman's bill would require all future presidential and vice presidential candidates to show their birth certificate to Texas's Secretary of State. It's a bill he says is fueled by his own doubts President Barack Obama was born in the United States. You know, that doesn't embarrass me if, if people call me a Bertha. I'm just a person who wants to see fact. I want to know for sure that the President of the United States is legally qualified to be president. And Berman says the president hasn't proven that. He won't show anything to show us where he was born. We don't even know where he went to school except by what he said. Nothing can be released on this man. Experts have verified Obama's original Hawaii birth certificate. Again and again, the director of that state's health department has confirmed he was born there. Old clippings from two local newspapers announce his parents had a son. It's not enough, though, to quell some critics. There was one little sentence. But still, that's a one record. One little sentence. But that's a record. It may be a record, but I challenge you to show that to me, and I challenge you to show me his certificate of live birth. You can't do it. With the conservative House behind him, Berman is convinced House Bill 295 can pass. Representative Debbie Riddle supports the measure. Well, if you're going to run for the highest office in the land, president, uh, in order to stop any kind of question that could diminish one's credibility. Like we've seen with uh, Obama, people have questioned that. Uh, I think, what's the harm? Democrats say Berman's bill is a sideshow based on dubious claims. I think people believe in Bigfoot too, even though they've never seen him. It's regrettable that some of my colleagues want to, uh, want to try to delegitimize the presidency and not focus on uh, on the issues at hand, like the budget, health care, and education. Freshman GOP lawmaker James White has a more nuanced view. Personally, I believe yes. Uh, from, from what I've seen, he is a citizen of the United States. But he was born in the United States? That he was born in the United States. Still, he says he supports Berman's bill. I just look at this as a constitutional issue. It's, it's in the Constitution. You're, you're supposed to be a natural born citizen. We should have some means to ensure that that's really the case. Bottom line, Berman says he's not alone in doubting the president's citizenship. There are birthers all over the state of Texas. There are millions of people who believe what I told you just a few minutes ago. He says they're driven by theories and videos circulating on the internet. When we're finished with this interview, I'll show you some YouTubes. You know, the YouTubes are uh, infallible. Representative Berman says he believes he has the support he needs to pass this bill through the House. He's not so sure about the Senate. In Austin with your Capital Buzz, I'm Tontan with the Texas Tribune.